Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the final part of Adoraju Play's Deadly Creatures. In this part, it's a convergence, as every plot point that has appeared... Uh, ooga booga booga. As every plot point that has appeared thus far is... Well, not exactly wrapped up, because some of it didn't really need wrapping up. But where we f finally see Strugs uh, meet his fate. Blech, pardon me. Now, we're in the bathroom of Str right now we're in the bathroom of Strug's gas station. It is a nasty, nasty, nasty place. What you're going to want to do, since you can't actually exit this uh, portal right here that's all full of gunk, until you wipe out the lizards that are here. Here's one, and there he goes. I think that's what you have to do. Then again, there are some things on the floor, too. Maybe you have to kill the rats that are on the floor. Or is it the lizards on the walls? Or maybe it's both. At any rate, there's also maggots in here, so you'll want to collect those if you can. I'm not sure what the hell that was that caused an earthquake in the bathroom. Maybe, uh... Maybe that's what happened. Maybe Strugs tried to flush Billy Bob Thornton down the toilet. <laughs> This'll get rid of you good. Get you. Oh. Ah! <laughs> I'm free fun! But we still need to get those rats down there. Get you a little closer. Uh, that's the end of him. I just want to hit you with my. I didn't even mean to do that. I just want to hit you with my tail and my claws. And once, twice, three times a vermin. So now that that's been done. The mysterious black fog lifts, and we can proceed on our way. Not sure exactly why, but whatever. Presumably, this the uh, scorpion is. Uh -huh. Presumably, the scorpion. Darn it! The leaf cricket got away. No, he didn't. There he is. Presumably, the scorpion is going through his little adventure in the bathroom, just as the tarantula is going through her little adventure out in the main lobby of the gas station. Just get up there. Come on. There it is. At any rate, now that we've uh, found our last, now that we found the last leaf cricket that we're going to bother to find, we're gonna head up and away. So now that we've actually managed to find a way out of the bathroom, hello, <sighs> bulb's dead. Good thing too, or else we might be fried. Not even realize it. Adventure goal complete. Exit the restroom. 200 points. New adventure goal. Reach the front porch. Where are you? <coughs> Fly into the scorpion zone. Ow! Get over there! That's the end of you. And the end of you. Bug off. I meant... I I meant to, uh... No, I didn't even mean to cut through. I meant to kill these things first. But will the game let me know? Something is dreadfully, drastically wrong. Well, at least we got rid of one of them. Wacko! Wacko! Smacko! 
So now that that's been done. Skittery, skittery, skittery! And through we go. Now this next area is kind of interesting because... Well, it's something of a gauntlet. No, I want to grab the cricket! I want it! Ugh. Because there's going to be a whole bunch of rats up coming up next. Sort of makes sense, though, that uh, deeper in the desert where the tarantula's burrow is, what what do we have out there? We've usually got beetles and uh, animals that don't really show any interest in, in dealing with humans. Now, here we've got things like rats, which uh, deal with humans on a daily basis. Get you. Stingalingaloo. Ow! Hey, you! I said, get, get it down, get down! No, no, no! Oh, somebody having a bad day. So now that we're through that gauntlet, let's uh, get the heck out of here. Oh, come on! The mysterious black fog is still in operation, and the creepy music is still playing, which tells me that there are more foes waiting to be bested. But where are they? Let's climb on top of this tyrant and look around. Oh boy, another rat. Okay, two more rats. One an albino. Let me sting your al- Oop. Ow! Hey, I got him! I got him! I got him again. Hey, you're gonna die. I'm Rat Lee. Floats like a butterfly, sting like a. Oh crap! And well, that's the end of him. Just a little more, and why don't you just die? Yes, like that. Thank you very much. How very convenient and thoughtful of you, <laughs> you dreadful little rat scallion. Rat scallion. Hey, there's a r lizard up here. Oh, jeez, there's a live lizard up here. No big deal. <laughs> Listen, you happen to be him, and I happen to be me, and you happen to be about six inches long. Actually, no, six inches, not even. So now that we've done that, we move on, moving on up in the world. Ah! How do we get... oh. And now we're on the front porch of this disgusting institution. Now, if you go over there, you can actually climb all over those gas pumps. And if you do that, you'll find loads and oodles of... You'll find loads of maggots. But, we're not going to be climbing them because we don't really need to find the gas pumps. I think I'll save my progress here because the next part is actually pretty darn tough. Now actually getting into the uh, institution is the tricky part. Let's just get up there and get a grub. Thank you, loading screen. I needed that. After we get up here, we are going to investigate the bug zapper. Hmm, it appears to run on some sort of electricity. It appears to be attracting bugs. It appears to be zapping them. So it's working! Ow! So now for this next part, what we want to do is try and uh, get rid of what we can by knocking our opponents into the bug zapper. Ow. Sort of like that. You could get go into the bug zapper yourself, but I don't recommend it because it'll hurt. Ow! Damn. Now get back. Oh! Well, that's terrifically convenient. Come on, you. Now, I'm not exactly sure... Yeah keep missing. At this point, I just want to get rid of you. 
take this, and this, and that, and this, and that too. So you just knock as many of these bugs as you can into the uh, bug zapper. Hey! Now was that fair? No, it was not. I was freaking poisoned. Uh, no, you know what? I've, I've had it with you guys. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to kill both of you. Yeah, that's right. You know why I'm going to kill both of you? It's because the final boss is coming right up. I'm going to need some energy in order to take him on. Or at least more health than I sure have now. Whoa, okay. He wasn't uh, paying as little attention as he seemed to be. Get you. And now that you've been knocked, you'll be rocked and sucked and stabbed like a bug. So let's get inside, shall we? This is uh, just an air vent. We'll enter through. Oh, what the hell? Same dialogue the tarantula heard. Bet you're behind the water heater, ain't ya? Huh? Nice and warm back there. I don't hear you. Come on. Just give me a rap. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Strugs is the final boss. We have to go up against this monster. You know, some video games have some pretty intimidating final bosses. Ganon. Shadow of the Colossus, but we get a redneck with a shotgun. But when you're the size of a tarantula, that's pretty impressive. Now, the first sting you're going to be able to get in uh, easy because he's not actually looking for you. You just climb up his pant legs, grab on when he moves, and and that's where that shotgun blast from before that lit the oil on fire came from. Struggs is not having a good day. I'll beat you out. You ain't hiding from me. So what we're gonna do right now is avoid him. Now every nope. Now what happens is he'll try and stomp on you, or he'll try and shoot you with the shotgun. Either way, get, get off, get off, get off. climb up his pant legs very quickly because. He'll stop to reload after he fires, or he'll stop to check his shoe after he tries to stomp on you. Depending on how this fight goes, it can go very fast or very, uh, not very fast at all. But we seem to have gotten lucky because we managed to get him all three times. On the higher difficulty, Strugs is dangerous, though. He does a lot of damage very quickly, and he can kill you in a heartbeat if he's not feeling cooperative. Uh-oh. I'm going out of here! One, two, three strikes, he's out! Oh, uh, three strikes, he's... Damn, in a coma. So that's it. That's what happened to Strugs, and... That's what happened to his gas station. So the tarantula and the scorpion meet one last time and then just go their separate ways. And there's that one last gold coin that everybody gave so much for. Well, that was Deadly Creatures, a very unusual, very distinctive, very short Wii title, all things considered. But it's entertaining, it's fun, it's original, and I recommend you give it a shot if you feel up to it. I am Mataraju, and I'll leave you with the end credits. I'll see you next time. Farewell.